There are 43 million young people and going into middle age and beyond who are trapped in predatory student loan debt. They happen to be very well networked. They're really good at self-organizing on the internet. There's only one place that they can put their votes in order to cancel their debt. My campaign is the only one that will do for uh, young people what our misleaders saw fit to do for Wall Street not that long ago when they bailed them out to the tune of like 16 or 17 trillion dollars when you count all the free loans that they got. But it was about four trillion in free money. There's a very compelling argument for it, not only because it's the right thing and the just thing, but it's also essential for our economy in order to liberate the real engine of creativity and inventing the new economy for the 21st century, etc. And also because social change is always led by the younger generation. Right now they are missing in action because they're very busy working two and three part-time lousy jobs in order to try to pay back these loans. So it's good all around. We're the only place those votes can go. 43 million is a winning plurality of the presidential race. Um, it's all about getting the word out. If that word gets out, millennials can come out and take over the election. By the way, on free college education, it pays for itself. So there may be some money to put in, but it's returned at a rate of about seven to one, according to the track record of the GI Bill following the Second World War, where basically, you know, returning GIs got free college education. And Congress was following the numbers. For every dollar that was put in, seven dollars were returned. So this is just bunk about it not being affordable. It's actually not affordable not to do it. it to me, it's unconscionable that we made this benefit available to crooks, but not to young people who've been victimized by the crashed economy caused by these crooks. I, I just don't get how that, that jives with basic human values. Why do you extend these benefits to these predators on Wall Street and you don't extend them to our younger generation? In my view, the right to a college education is a right uh, because you don't throw your kids into the ocean and hope that they are going to be able to swim. You teach them how to swim. Well, swimming in the economy used to mean getting a high school education. But in the 21st century, it means getting a college education. So going forward, to me, by right, this is what we provide our younger generation. We provide them with a college education so they can survive in the economy of today. And that that is right and just, that we should do that retroactively, given how they have been absolutely screwed in this. They were basically entrapped into these loans, entrapped into these loans under very false pretenses. And we all suffer for their being uh, missing in action from society in general. Progress is always led by the younger generation. And if they're not here to lead it, we are all dead in the water. So it's to all of our benefit that we liberate them.